you're about to have a KOL visit and you know that he wants to talk about tumor DNA and using biomarkers for optimizing clinical research. You need to refresh your knowledge about the subject and you want to have some examples on hand that you can discuss with him. But you don't want to spend hours searching through PubMed to find the latest publications in this area. But then you remember that your company just subscribed to MACG and MACG can search PubMed effectively, efficiently, and accurately. So you hop on over to MACG and you type in your prompt. You turn on the PubMed toggle so that MACG knows that it's going to be searching PubMed. And you click execute. And your results begin to appear. Complete with hyperlinks to the original article. Which you can click to. Also has short summaries as well, publication dates. And as you can see, these are all 2024, which is within the last two years. That's our 10th article. Now it's writing the 250 word overview based on the search results. And here we are. We have our 10 citations here. You can even take a look at them to make sure that these or what you're looking for, you can click on any one of them and it'll take you directly to the PubMed record so that you can verify that that's the correct article. And you can even read more details about the abstract or obtain the article if you, if you have access to it. And let's look at the summary that it gave us. So a 250 word overview. You can read that and um, you can have it on hand as you discuss with your HCP. And very importantly, you now have a nice list of articles that you can provide to him as well, and he can look at them at his own time. So you now have a leave behind that you can leave for the HCP. And this is our original prompt, find 10 articles about um, circulating tumor DNA to guide dose optimization in clinical trials that's published within the last two years and write a 250 word um, overview. And MACG did all that in one stroke. And you're on your way, ready to have your meeting with your ACP. And you can even create a document from this as well just by clicking create document. And now it's in the edit, the MACG editor, which is a full editor that you can use to shape this as you see fit. And if you wanted to create a bibliography, that's very easy as well. You can navigate over to the citation generator, which houses all the citations that were extracted from the references and just click insert bibliography. And voila, you have your bibliography which makes a very nice handout that you can provide to your HCP. All complete with all the authors and all the details.